Okay, we are going to talk about the O'Reilly database, how to use this today. And O'Reilly is a great database for anything technology related. It also has a lot of good management information, marketing, uh, project management. It's, it's best known for uh, technology. But let's go in here. I'll go to library databases A to Z. So let's make sure I went kind of quick there. I went library databases A to Z. Then I'm just going to click O. There's O'Reilly Online Learning right there. Click on it, and you might uh, sometimes a little box will come up that says, "Okay, we're going to go in." The, like you'll have to click a couple of boxes to get into it, uh, but it's it's pretty easy to use. It's pretty intuitive. I'll just do a search here for Python, and there's all these things that come back once this loads for Python. So it's nice here. You could look just at books. You could look at courses. These are going to be video courses. And any of these things you want, you would just open it up here. And you just click play to start watching this course. So it's a full course. It's a full course on Python. Uh, let's go back here. You have to accept cookies a lot on here. Videos. These are just straight videos. Um, audiobooks, which is kind of cool. I haven't seen any other databases we have that have audiobooks, but there's audiobooks you could listen to. And you could also go to playlists. And these are playlists that have been created uh, by experts at O'Reilly to put you on the learning path for, for that thing. You could also, it's sorting by relevance now. Let's go back to books. It's sorting by relevance. If you wanted to sort by publication date, you could click right there so that you could see the newest things first. You could also, you could go in here and limit by a publisher. Let's say you wanted to, let's find a good one in here. O'Reilly is a big publisher. We could do that. There's O'Reilly right there. And that's what O'Reilly really is known for are these technical manuals. Um, but this database doesn't just search O'Reilly. It searches all kinds of different all the kinds of different publishers of materials. Let's go in here and you could grab as many as, as you would want if you wanted to see the For Dummies books. Now you get the O'Reilly things and if you look through here you'll find some For Dummies things as well. There's a Python Essentials for Dummies. And that's that's pretty much how it works. It's, it's, it's pretty easy. You could also, now any of these things that you want, you could add to a playlist. And you don't have to log in. There's no separate login to get to your, your My O'Reilly. If, if I added this to a playlist, I have these two playlists going in here already. Um, I could add this to my Python playlist. And when I go to my playlist, it knows who I am just from my computer. So if I go to my playlists here, I've got my Python playlist and my machine learning playlist. And then I could go back to just kind of my, my little bookshelf of things here. Um, let's go back to the beginning here. You could also, if you weren't really sure what you were looking for, you could look. There's things that are featured here on the first page here. You could also go in and just go topics. You could browse to the different topics. You could view all. And then you could look through all their topics here and click on something, let's say. We'll go Cisco certifications. What do they have on Cisco certifications? And then once you're in there with Cisco certifications, you could, you could limit it by book. All the same things we had talked about before. By courses. These are online courses through here videos, 
audiobooks, etc. You could also just go from here, cloud computing, let's see what they have under how about Azure. And the same thing. So it's a pretty it's a pretty easy database to use. It's a pretty easy database to to search and to browse. They've they've made it pretty simple. And it's it's a really great database. It's uh, the only database I know of that's similar to it would be LinkedIn Learning. Uh, but LinkedIn Learning is is pretty much just videos, video courses. And this has books and video courses and videos and audio books and all these other things too. So it's a really great database, really easy to use. Uh, let us know in the library if you need any help with this, but we're very excited to be offering this database now. Thank you very much.